Unitil is an electric and gas utility company operating in New Hampshire and Massachusetts. Our gas operations is based in Fitchburg where we supply 15,000 customers with gas. And annually we upgrade in excess of 10,000 feet of unprotected pipe. Last year we introduced live insertion technology to our replacement program by inserting approximately 7,500 feet of 4 inch low pressure main with 2 inch plastic pipe operating at 100 pounds. This initiative has been a great success and we are now completing our second construction season using this technology. This year we will have replaced over 8,000 feet through this technique and the economic savings alone excluding pipe material, permitting and traffic control is approximately 38%. This video documents a part of the Water Street project which we are just completing using live insertion. It not only shows the uh, different elements of live insertion in action but it also demonstrates how the technology integrates seamlessly with traditional mainlaying techniques. This is Unitil's existing gas distribution system in the southeast sector of Fitchburg. Red signifies high pressure and blue low pressure gas mains. On completion of the Water Street project, approximately 6,000 feet of low pressure main will have been upgraded to high pressure and 96 services upgraded and transferred over. Of this total amount, 5,425 feet will have been upgraded using live gas insertion technology and these sections are identified by orange highlight. This video focuses on Dover Street, a 360 foot dead end section of 4 inch cast iron main serving 5 customers which is to be live inserted with 2 inch high density polyethylene pipe. The pipe south of location 1 has previously been live inserted. The existing low pressure main remains live but the inserted 2 inch pipe has not yet been gassed up. However, once Dover Street is live inserted, the mains will be tested and commissioned to gas. The bulk of the work shown in this video takes place at location 1, where the live insertion push takes place. Site preparation, machine setup, live insertion and main tie-ins. During a previous push, the horizontal section of low pressure main had been live inserted with 2 inch pipe and the end of the inserted pipe had been retrieved with a permanent end seal kit installed to ensure a long term gas tight seal. During the initial site preparation a 2 inch diameter bypass had been established and a bag stop inserted immediately downstream of where the main is to be live inserted. The video commences with the installation of a temporary insertion kit which completes the isolation of the low pressure T in preparation for live insertion. Once the foam sets and a gas tight seal is established, the cast iron pipe is cut and the T removed to facilitate the installation of the live insertion gland and pushing machine. The low pressure main is inserted 360 feet to the end cap at location 2. The live insertion gland provides a gas tight seal between the 4 inch low pressure carrier pipe and the 2 inch high pressure inserted pipe. On completion of the live insertion push, the pushing machine is dismantled and removed from the trench. A permanent end seal is installed and a high density polyethylene T is tied in to make a final connection. 
The next stage in the live insertion procedure takes place at location 2, where the end of the inserted main is retrieved and the end service upgraded. The inserted pipe is not yet live, but the existing services continue to be supplied from the low pressure main. The carrier main is drilled and a temporary insertion kit installed to isolate the end section of low pressure main and the service to be upgraded. Once the foam is cured, the service and main are cut. The carrier pipe is broken out and removed to expose the newly inserted pipe with the nose cone attachment. A permanent end seal kit is installed. The nose cone is retrieved and an end cap is fused in its place. A service tapping tee is installed and the new high pressure service is laid, terminating to an external meter position. Finally, but not shown in this video, the inserted mains and the services are pressure tested, purged to gas and commissioned. Subsequent service upgrades are progressively carried out in the direction from location 2 back towards location 1.